Hey students, thank you for choosing Ivory Research to guide you through writing the best expository essay. Be sure to hit the subscribe button for more incredible instructional videos to assist your academic career. Choosing to further your academic career with the assistance of Ivory Research can help you obtain the grades you deserve and the high paid jobs you deserve as well. With many years of providing assistance with personal statements, CVs, and not forgetting the all important essays and dissertations, Ivory Research can help you with your academic journey at every step of the way. If you are too busy to watch this video, don't worry. Hop on over to ivoryresearch.com where you'll find all the crucial information on this subject and lots more with our complete student assistance programs. First of all, what actually is an expository style essay? An expository style essay is a piece of writing that investigates a central idea, provides both sides of the concept with expansion ideas and development, and tests and demonstrates your knowledge around the central theme or idea. In essence, to expose the information for the reader. An expository essay is not one to demonstrate and argue your point of view or belief, but to fully explore the fors and against the theme. You will find that the given theme or idea will either be a positive or a negative to start. The idea of the expository essay is to discuss both sides of the concept, one side in agreement with the theme and the other on the opposite side to the argument. The general rule to be followed with an expository essay, explain, fully explain the point with clarity. Inform, inform the reader of the issues and evidence surrounding the point. Describe, describe how the information relates back to the point in hand. By following this structure within the body paragraphs of your text, you will give the reader a crystal clear understanding of the matter at hand and allow the text to flow. Let's look at an ideal structure for an expository essay, shall we? As with all essays, an excellent introduction is always going to be the best thing that opens your paper with ease. Opening with your theme or idea to discuss in the, the introduction can be brief and point out maybe three major areas that will be addressed within. An introduction does not have to be complicated, but direct is always the going to be the best. An expository essay will need a theme or a central idea, and these are likely to start with the instructions. Define, explain, investigate, describe. So opening your essay with the exact idea or theme that it will be based on is a great idea. Following that, with the background of the paper's theme, laying down a few concise ideas about where the initial idea came from and how it came to be thought of in a particular way. The final part of your introduction should be about the thesis statement, which in expository essays can vary depending on the topic. So follow as much of the guidance that you have been given. Then comes your paragraphs that will form the body of your expository essay, of which at least three, but no more than five, concise paragraphs which would follow the explaining form described formula. So to recap, this is explain, fully explain the point with clarity, inform, inform the reader of the issues and evidence surrounding the point, describe, describe how the information relates back to the point in hand. Expository essays are really not as scary as they seem if you follow a structure and do all of the necessary and appropriate research. Your conclusion in an expository essay is one where you are required to summarise your main points of the essay to give your topics further validity and not to make any new points that do not have the backing in the text. So if you recap the points one by one in a briefer and more unstructured way within the conclusion, you can draw the matter to a close with just a few lines at the end of the conclusion that brings all the ideas into an apparent response to the original central theme or idea. The best thing about a conclusion in an expository essay is that all of the relevant backing up and points have been adequately explored and evidenced throughout the text. So only a brief reiteration is required. And that is your expository essay complete, yeah. We hope you found this video super helpful in writing your expository essay. Be sure to let us know how you got on and come back and visit us for more videos on your student career path. If you need any more help, 
right in your expository essay, make sure you come and join us at www.ivoryresearch.com. Till next time, come on.